Mr. Donaghy, I represent Rhode Island's first congressional district. It's a diverse community, from the hardworking moms and dads of Smithfield to those spoiled jags at Brown to a thriving, flourishing Italian criminal community in Providence. It's my responsibility to make sure that public airwaves represent the face of my public. Now, one question. Why is it that NBC looks about as diverse as a Wilco concert? I would point to um, uh, Sunday Night Football, which features many black players and coaches. Oh, and uh, we have uh, Anthony Anderson, the star of Law and Order, which is entering its 21st. Uh... What? Why did we cancel that? That doesn't make any sense. Mr. Donaghy, this may just be about money to you, but as a member of Congress and a black woman... Uh, I don't really see color or gender, Mr. Chang. I feel I have an extra duty, not just to my constituents, but to future generations. Now, unless I see some serious change at NBC, and soon, I can guarantee you this deal will not happen. Rhubarb, 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 peas and carrots, rhubarb, rhubarb, peas and carrots, rhubarb. Dot com. You run Tracy's production company, right? Yes, dot com productions. That's Tracy Jordan spelled backwards. Well, I need programming for the African-American community, and nobody knows that demographic better than you. But don't worry about it, Jackie D. I'm on it. Call Grizz. I need someone around who's not just a yes man. Whatever you say, Trey. Oh, come on, Walter. So, what do we want to see on TV? I personally love cop shows. I can't wait for Law & Order to start back up. Why? It was a tent pole! A tent pole! Well, here's something I've been working on. It's called Let's Stay Together. After the Al Green song, it focuses on an African-American family in Detroit in the 70s. Motown, the auto industry, Vietnam, Watergate. Let's Stay Together is not just about a family trying to stay together, but also a nation. What if there was a talking dog? I'd like to see that incorporated into your rewrite. OK, meeting over. The only thing that worked in the read-through was the dog. How's production going, Trey? Good. And there's a lot of buzz. Can you hear it, too? Or is my tinnitus acting up? Hey, that food is for Dot Com Productions only. TGS's food is backstage. But they don't have women's sports bars. Men can have cramping, too, you know. Studio 6H, uh, home to one of NBC's biggest stars, Tracy Jordan. Mr. Jordan, Regina Bookman. We met at the Congressional Black Caucus fundraiser you crashed your motorcycle into. And thank you, Representative. What you're doing is very important. I can assure you that NBC is committed to making diversity our priority. Then just walk away and don't try to kiss her, Tracy, and don't say that last part. 